welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name is Mark Hoffman. Today I'm to take you around our 2013 CX-9 Classic. As you've seen for inquiry in the car, exceptionally low kilometres with only 30,000 kilometres on the car. This video is going to be mostly about condition and quality. Starting at the front, we do have the update CX-9 shape. Such a good shape. I really, really like this. Big black grille, chrome everywhere. Beautiful metallic grey paint on the car as well, silver. Um, coming down to the bottom, I'm being picky on cars today and I can't find any sort of damage anywhere. That is the tiniest little bit of dirt there. There's no stone chips at all on the front of the car. Headlights present brilliantly. They are the projector beam, so better at night time. No signs of stone chips at all across the bonnet or the top of the bumper bar there. Nothing on this guard here. First to the alloy wheels, factory of course. No gutter rash at all and a brilliant condition tire on the front of this car. What have we got? We've got Bridgestone Jewel or Highway Terrain tires on the front of this car. Coming down the driver's side, we've got indicators in the mirrors, nice big mirrors. We do have window tinting all the way around on the vehicle. I really do like the chrome trip that goes all the way around the windows, a good look. We do have a small little scratch just there on the middle of the driver's door if I'm to be picky on the car. Coming along the driver's door a little bit more, we've got a tiny little depression in the paint just there. And to the rear of the car, yet again, this one's been touched up though, a little scratch just there. Coming to the rear of the car now, no gutter rash at all on the wheel at the back. Yet again, we've got Bridgestone dual or highway terrain tyre, heaps of tread at the back there. Coming to the rear of the CX-9 now, a little bit to talk about here. Obviously, high mat stoplight. We do have the uh, tinted rear window. We've got the rear wiper for the mornings. Reversing camera, dual exhaust tips as well. First thing I know is I always look at the rear bar to see how people load things in and out. And no scuffs or anything across there. Presents really well. Open the tailgate now. Comes clean out of our way. Nice and high. Gas struts take it up. We've got a bag. Hello. I probably should look in these things before doing the videos. Ah, we've got a all of the floor mats for the car. That's nice to see. So we've got floor mats for the vehicle. I'll just pop that out of there for a moment. In the rear now, you'll notice carpet, as I mentioned before, no signs of scuffs or anything on this plastic trim as well. We've got it set up with the seat, sort of showing you how it works at the moment, as the third row is a 50-50 is a split, so you can still put items here, which is a good thing to do. Um, heaps of leg room for the third row passenger as well. They also get cup holders in the, in the rear area as well. Simple matter of to fold the seats down, and when you do, you'll notice over here we've got a 12 volt socket, so the third row passenger can charge their iPad, or you can put a little uh, fridge back here. So it's pretty versatile. Little jug here, I like these. People ask, what are they for? You have a jug of milk in a bag and it roams around the back, you just hook it on there, and it doesn't go anywhere. Great little idea. In here, room for your tools, and I think the previous owner had a Miele vacuum cleaner. I'll hide this in the car somewhere. See if you can find it when you come in to view the vehicle. Anyway, we'll uh, shut the tailgate and move on along. In the, This is the passenger side, generally where you see damage if there was to be any on the vehicle. And really, really clean on this side. Rear wheel, no gutter rash at all. Brilliant condition Bridgestone tyre on the back. No marks around the filler cap, which commonly happens. No marks in the door caps. Nothing on this door at all. Coming to the front door, yet again, nothing. Mirror presents brilliant. Coming up to the last of the wheels now, unmarked, no gutter rash at all, and a brilliant condition Bridgestone dual or highway terrain tyre on the front. So around the exterior of the vehicle, really good condition. Into the front of the CX-9, now let's talk about the engine. Really nice engine in this car. You're looking at a 3.7 litre V6. It's going to give you a massive 204 kilowatts of power, 367 newton metres of torque. Through a six-speed automatic, you're still going to get 11 litres to the 100. Out of 76 litre tank, that's in excess of 690 kilometres of average driving range. Inside the CX-9 Classic now and um, really really spacious quite a large car but really comfy as well um, love the armrest and the high mount center console that's really nifty you don't have to reach down for anything quite nice we'll start at the start steering wheel is obviously height and reach adjustable set it where you like it lock it away nice and easy right hand side cruise control left hand side we've got our media controls as well as bluetooth phone Left stalk, we've got automatic front wiper. Brilliant feature. A little bit of rain hits the top of the windscreen. Wipers flash. Really nice. Rear control as well. Really nice sports dials on the CX-9 there. Car currently showing just over 31,000 kilometres. Right hand side, we've got automatic headlights. They are dusk sensing, so they turn, off, turn on at night time. Do remember, they don't work in the rain. You do have to turn your headlights on in the rain. We do also have a front fog lamp for when it's foggy. Do have two factory keys with this car. Coming down the driver's side now, we've got... Um, 
factory uh, power mirrors as well as four door power windows automatic on the front too and a door lock on the door i like the cloth trims and the leather on the door really softens the car up a bit across and into the center center there we have our little trip computer as well as the aircon display and a clock button here to test all the indicators at once going down into the audio system so it's fully featured we've got am fm also have bluetooth as well as cd there as well which slots in just there down from there i'll just move the shifter out of the way we've got our dual zone climate control so driver and passenger and you can set fan and where you want it all to go and of course there and then your rear you can turn that off if you want to bake the kids in the back 12 volt socket there to charge your phone as well as a little holder to put your phone in um, just click it into reverse while we're at the audio system shows a nice reversing camera there and a good wide angle as well so if you're parallel parked you can actually see really if there's a van or something next to you you can see down the road a nice feature um, shifter as I just mentioned we're in reverse but then you go into D for, for D for drive and if you're feeling extra sporty you can click it over into manual mode and control it that way as well two giant cup holders in there you can also pull out the center to make it a big big bin of many things in here they fold open differently but that's a pretty cool way of doing it down here we've got another 12 volt usb and auxiliary input there as well um, going around the interior now presents really really well um, no signs of any rips or tears or anything like that in the cloth interior it does have floor mats in the bag in the back so the carpets present really really well you notice the rear air conditioning set up here for which you can turn off or you can allow the uh, people in the back to play with the air conditioning um, the seats do fold very differently in the CX-9 you've got runners all over the place so you can actually roll them forward and back and all sorts of fun things um, ISO fixed seat mounting points as well as the normal anchor points of course um, airbags we do have many we've got dual front dual side dual side curtain as well so as we come up to the front we'll jump into the service books I like Mazda books they're very very easy we've had the original service which is the thousand kilometer nut and bolt one which is done shows a good owner that does that service and then we've got the 10, the 20, and the 30, and the car is currently showing 31,000 kilometers. So freshly serviced, freshly roadworthied, and ready to go. All right, thank you for joining me on a walk around tour of our CX-9. As you've seen, brilliant condition outside, great condition tires, inside every option you want, brilliant size for the family as well full service history ready to go do be very quick for this car give us a call 9907 555 and thank you for watching